Hello and welcome, and welcome back to Minecraft. It's me again. You, you should know who I am by now. It's me, DZ Maven. Back again. There's my village behind me. Probably see I've done a few little things with it. Uh, one thing I need to say real quick here. Um, I do notice in my last video, sometimes I do tend to get a little over overexcited. And I might let slip a few words that maybe I shouldn't say. So I've uh, I d I've done some thinking about that. So so should I um, let let get overexcited again and let slip some words? Um, like say, oh, let's say if I decide to get overexcited and say uh, puppies, um, that's going to be um, replaced by the word puppies now. So so I won't have to worry about that. Um, have to uh, sim uh, sim simply because I have to be. I have to be a little mindful that these are Minecraft videos, and they do, and and the and they do tend to attract a young a younger audience. So I probably need to keep that in mind when I'm making them. So, because I, I know I did I did I did I did let let slip a few things last time, and since I am doing doing video editing, there's really no excuse no excuse why I why why I can't do that now. So anyway, but anyway, but now that's out of the way. Can get on the things. Let's turn off my coordinates again. Yes, I've taken I've taken damage again. But let me uh, show you around here what I've done so far. I've made a fence all the way around. Worked up a uh, perimeter fence to keep the mobs out as best I can here. I built steps up into the door so that the villagers can actually get inside. I have lit the place up as well as I can. I'm uh, growing some fresh wheat over here too now. It was full of carrots before, I believe. Um, I've expanded the fence out over to here. I've extended it out all the way out to the water. I made a little pin over here. These guys are bunched up over here, but they can find their way inside. I tried to um, fix the area up a little bit. Still a lot of grass here. I'm going to get rid of the grass. I lured a few animals over here. Some sheep. And I think there's some cows I got over there. Um, originally, I didn't have the fence right here because I wanted to be... Um, I wanted to have like a beach a, a beachhead right here. Extending out to the water. The problem is... Um, I did spend a couple of nights out in the open just testing out how well the uh, the uh, monster mobs uh, can uh, react to this. Um, most of them can't get around the fence um, except at these corner areas. I tried to uh, route the water so that flows that way so that they can't walk around and get around the fence. Uh, the problem is that the zombies do um, start to pack up. And they can push themselves through the water, up and up and around. So I kind of had to um, make a fence to go all the way around now to just block them, because otherwise they just kept pouring around the corners. And that's why I took some damage, because I would I spent about two nights um, testing out my uh, my uh, fenced area here, and I did the same thing over here at this corner too, but uh, but this, this, this wa the water kind of slows them down a little bit, but it, it didn't really stop them entirely. Uh, you can hear some zombies right here. Uh, there was a cave under here. I went down there and dug out a lot of stone that I used to um, fix up the, uh, vil the uh, village a little bit here. And there were trees, there was a small forest right there. I took all those trees down and use the wood to build a fence all the way around and gather some wood and supplies. Uh, there should be another cow. I only have one here. Uh, it might be over here somewhere. But yeah, I added stairs so everybody could get inside. I made a little pin over here for my donkey. I don't I don't think he no no, no, no he cannot uh, get out of here because that's only one it's only a, a one wide gap. Oh, got a little baby cow. Ready? Cool. So, and I have something in mind I'm gonna do on 
do in this episode. You know? I'm probably gonna die doing it, so that's why I figured I'd film it before before I died off camera. Oh, there's one dog oh, with creeper up there. I can get, I can take care of him. I guess I'm gonna have to light the uh, tops of the buildings up too now. I haven't had too much trouble with mobs now that I've fenced up the entire area. Yeah, I think I'm pretty much okay. I guess I'm just going to have to keep an eye on, eye on the rooftops now. Hey zombie. You're not even looking at me. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and make it daytime and get on to what I plan to do here. I, I, I've made this my my uh, my house here, and you're um, staying with me. I see. Uh, I got my stove, workbench, got a double chest to put all, all my stuff in here. I'm running low on iron, so I need to go um, caving. And I got a bunch of supplies over here. I gathered up um, clay, wood, some sand. What do I have on right now? Bucket, a couple swords. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to go go caving here. In fact, I might want to have another pick here. Don't need gunpowder. Got a little bit of stone. Let me make some stone picks here. I'm going to try and save my iron pick here for um, any type of gold or anything else that's important, I find. Got a water bucket. I got plenty of dirt. And I think this is the last of my coal. Oh, huh. Uh, yeah, huh. It's also confusing. Okay, but anyway, um... Let me talk about over here. Oh yeah, this cave over here. Um, I dug this whole area out, but under here. I got all the stone. And I kind of sealed it back up and left it dark, because uh, I'm hoping to, um... I'm hoping this will be like a, uh, honeypot here. Um, if you've never heard that term, it's something that uh, Vex talks about sometimes. Um, basically, the uh, it's the creation of a a um, a uh, dark space for mobs to spawn in, so they don't spawn elsewhere. I don't know how effective that's going to be here, but I mean, I'm hoping it might help a little bit. Um, but anyway, over here there's some caves. This is where all the trees were. And when I was cut, cutting these trees down, um, I did hear a lot of noises over in this area. This, uh, th this area right here. And I was uh, suspecting there might have been, might be a spawner, spawner over here somewhere. Because cause when I was cutting the trees down, a little uh, baby zombie spawned right here when I was cutting the trees down. And just made a beeline right, right for the village. And I had to go like chasing after it. Because because I, I, di I did not have my fences up yet, and just went just went went right after my uh, my uh, my, uh, my uh, villager people, and that and that, that little thing was fast. So I, I'm wondering if there was a spawner here because he, he spawned on the surface in the, in the daytime when I was working, and so I was gonna go down here and see if I could find something. There's nothing over here. So I'm gonna try. Well, there's nothing on this side either. I'm gonna try over here. I did go down here before, and there was a skeleton. Then I came back out. Cause I didn't want to get shot off camera. It's just sand. There is iron, though. I will take that. Well, 
don't know what. That wasn't much. I'm thinking there's still got to be something around here. I've... Yeah, I think I put a torch somewhere. Yeah, right here. But I wanted to investigate. I'll dig down a little bit. Oh, there is a cave here. Okay. Oh, it's not much of a cave. It goes this way. Alright, let's see where it goes. Ah, oh, it's a bat. Sandstone. Okay, this did not go very far. Okay, I was mistaken. There is no spawner here. It's just... It's just a tiny cave. I'll take the coal, though. There's no water there. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to go uh, resource hunting. Takes... Oh, this goes down. That goes way down. Yeah, go down there, bat. Oh, lava. Oh, this is a ravine. Okay, okay. I can probably work I can probably work with this. Hmm. I like to be able to see what's at the bottom. Okay, let me make a easy way to get back up here before I get too far. Okay, let's, let's mark this. Light it up a little bit. Put that torch there. I'm going to fill this up so I don't fall in there. Mm, okay. Let's keep exploring here. Take this sandstone. Uh, that goes quite a ways down. Oh! Mineshaft and a chest. I must have it. I must have it. I want... I want it. I want the goodies. This way. Don't mind collecting all the stone because I can use it for a bit for a uh, building material later on. Provided I don't die down here, I can make my way back up. Iron, I'll take that. Oh, that drops down. Some light. <laughs> digging, digging, digging. Digging towards loot. And some more iron. Iron, iron, iron. I will take it. Yes, I hear the spiders. I don't know where they are right now, but I guess I'll figure it out when I get down there. Oh, some coal down there. Um, let's see, I need to make a stairway down. I think I want to light that up over there so I can see. Don't anything fall on my head. Oh, I see a spider. So there. Oh, yeah. It's one of those things. Okay. I'm gonna stay away from that. But I wanna get down there. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, no, I don't want to be in here. out a little bit more. There may not be anything over here. Diamond. Red. Oh, another iron pick, okay. I will take it. Let's see what we got over here. Is there anything over here? Anything? Lava. Here's something. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. Yeah, you just stay over there. What is that over there? Is that a zombie spawner? have on me right now. I'll take this wood. Actually what would be a good idea is me just collect stuff right now and just stick it in that chest for the time being. I think that's what I'm collecting to do here. Before um, something unfortunate befalls me here. But we'll take that. I do like to take all the wood out of mine shafts. Because I can always use it. And it also gives me a clear idea of uh, where I've been in the mine shaft. Actually, I don't really like this chest being right here. Can I um, just take that? Put that someplace else. Let's put it on. a block there so I can get up. I'm gonna put the uh, chest... I'm gonna put it right there. I'm gonna put some of this stuff in there for now. Just in case I die. I don't want to lose everything I got. I need torches. No, 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 give me my... Give me that back. I do want these too. I want everything. time. I'm at about 20 minutes here now. Alright, I'm gonna go investigate that spawner here in a moment. I need a torch over here too. get so obsessive about all this wood here. Okay. 
put half of that in there, put the fences, that, put the gravel in there. Uh, I guess that's alright. Okay, I wanna see what that is over there. You came out of there, so I'm really... I'm close enough to set it off right now, let me see what happens. Anything? Yep, oh, zombie. Haha. -ha. So maybe I was right. Maybe. So, so yeah, zombie spawn of that. That might. Mm, well, actually, that no, that's actually way too far down for me to have heard it. But I want to get closer to it. Go away, gravel. Oh, this is awful, gravel. Here. I'm gonna go this way. More gravel. It's lava. This way. I like that gravel. Let's see, I wanna get over there. Put that there. Why does it have to be gravel right here? I don't like gravel. Go away, gravel. There goes my first pick. Yep, that is a little dungeon. Okay, let me get rid of you guys for a moment because I want to take a look at that. I want to get over here. Don't want anything sneaking up on me yet. Take that. get here. Take a peek here. There's one chest. Uh, there's two. There's two. They're on the other side. Gotta get to them. I need to shut this thing off for a moment. Move. Hey, you're in the way. Move. Punch you to death. Punch you with a torch. Come on, experience. I'll use an axe on you. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna work my way around. This uh, this is actually pretty good. I, I like this. Because uh, I can turn this into a little bit of a e EXP grinder. Because zombies give out a little bit more EXP over spiders and skeletons. And this is actually deep enough down that I think I could probably turn it into a uh, drop trap pre pre uh, pretty easily. Get over on this side, but I want uh, I want the uh, chest first. Chestos, I want the chesto. I think I might be okay. Well, I better put a sword back in my hand first. <laughs> Let me give it to you. No surprises.
Should be okay. Alright, what do we got? Record, strings, strings, iron, I need iron. No saddle. Shaddle, shaddle. Gunpowder, disc. Okay. And more iron. This is almost the same thing again. Hmm. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright. Um, that was okay, I guess. Uh, it wasn't wasn't the best best kind of loot. And I have no axe. Uh, okay. Uh, if it had been ideal, I would have gotten a um a another um, enchantment book or a uh, name tag. Would would have been nice. But um, having the uh, zombie spawner is uh, still pretty good. I like that. All right. I need to eat. They're getting to eat. One poke chop. That does it. Okay, I'm gonna come back for the zombie spawner later and maybe do something with it. Oh, you're hiding over there. I see you. And darkness over there. I'm not gonna mess with that. Did I see some? I saw some coal somewhere. I'm gonna grab that. And I think I'm gonna head back up. Yeah, yeah, I wanna get this. Because I need coal. Need more of this. Now I know I got a poison spider spawner around the corner over here. Which I have abso absolutely no use for. Which I will probably do something about in another episode. This is a little dark. I'll light that up for a moment. Um, eventually I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come back through here and try to square all this off a little bit. A little better here. Yeah, I need to make another axe. Okay, let's see. I'm going to take that back up. The iron. Iron pick. Try and take all this back up with me. That block string. I'll take the fences. The wood. Uh, the rest of this I don't need. Let's take a quick peek. There's a creeper down there. Actually, it would be a good idea for me to put some safety rails up. There we go. Yeah, I saw that spider spawner over there somewhere. Oh well, I'm being close to my half hour mark here, so I'm gonna head back up. So, surprisingly enough, I did not die. Well, I probably shouldn't say that before I get out of here. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I probably said that a little too early. But I could probably outrun them. Well, let's see, it's a night time outside. No, it is not. Good. Perfecto. It is perfecto. Yeah, great sheep. And I picked up a zombie flesh, which I don't need. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 You're the same guy again. You didn't leave. Okay, one diamond. Uh, I got some iron. I need to cook that up right away here. Put that in there. Uh, an extra iron pick. Zombie flesh string, saddle, gunpowder, more string. A little more stone. Put that over there. And I'm going to lay my chest out again. Eventually I'm going to need to organize this a little better here. Let me put... Actually, no, I'm sitting stone over here. Put the 
disc in there. I put the saddle in there too. Give me that other saddle. There. Iron in there, so I got 18. That's my fences. Put that in there. Put that other record in there. I guess that's gonna be about it. Alright. Okay. Well, I guess that's gonna be about it. Uh, found the zombie spawner, did a little bit of caving. Um, probably do a little bit more again off camera here. And well, actually, I don't know if I, I don't know if I should do that or not, or I should just expand the, vi the, uh, vi the uh, village some more because I mean I don't, I don't want to end up dying off camera I, I, I would rather wait and, and record that but anyway uh, this is what I've been up to it's the village has been improved a little bit and I'm going to continue improving it yep and that's pretty much it um, I'll probably do a video where I try to make a um, a uh, grinder out of that spawner at some point. So that's something to look forward to. So anyway, that's going to be it for now. Take care. See you later. Bye-bye.